Sorry, someone came in my room. I can talk for a little longer and I'll shut this cow up here. Yeah, that's my final offer for Mel and Peter Jackson. This is part three, guys. Someone came in my room. I had to shut the camera off. I don't want you guys hearing, hearing the conversation, right? <laughs> that's why I always shut the camera off when someone comes in my room. Yeah. And I'll make Zayn's for $1.2 billion. And you guys already know how the, how the salary, how the... Uh, the budget is split, obviously. Split into three parts. Documentary, movie budget, and... Uh, that's why I'm going to tell the engineers. I want it split into three vo into three uh, uh, sections. Tell the engineers, okay, I have new... Yeah, I want it... I want, when I put one point two billion dollars into the movie, I want the thing split. That way everything's organized. Ivan, what do you mean? Okay, I want, I want the thing split... I want, I want, I want all, I want, I want, I want the, the, the budget split. Like, tell the editors of you know, okay, Ivan, yeah, I want a, a section for, for, for documentary. That way, well, that way, while the seventh team are making all these calls, we know how much money is getting burned for all these sections. We know how much money has been burned, for, burned so far for the doc, how much money has it burned so far for the salaries, how much money has it burned so far for the movie budget. And in the movie budget, I want sections split too. I what do you mean? Okay, I want um, I want I only want the section split for the I only want the section split for the movie for the main stuff. So I want I want the I want the, I want the uh, the visual effects technology split, the set building, the cameras, the costumes, arm and weapons, and the extras. Those five sections I want it split. And everything else you don't you don't have to split that 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 you just pay with, with, with through the budget you don't want, you don't you don't have to uh, um, 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 keep track of the other stuff because the other stuff is all pocket change but the main stuff you have to split that too right yeah oh so I yeah I want I, within the seven eighty million dollar budget I want I want I I want uh, I want I want uh, five five of the sections but okay Ivan what do you want to split okay. I want the, the, the visual effects technology split. Yeah, Ivan, mean, how much pulling towards that? Six hundred million dollars. The set building I want that split. I'm putting thirty three million towards the set building. The extras I'm putting the same thing, thirty three, thirty four million dollars towards extras. Obviously. Costumes, arm and weapons, I'm gonna put I have to put I'm gonna put a good thirty seven, thirty eight million dollars towards that. And the cameras, I'll put a good twelve million towards the budget for the cameras. So I can do the math here. So out of the seven eighty, how much of that is how much of how, how much money has been burned so far? And the rest, the rest of the money is going towards the food. You don't have to split it towards the food. That's pocket change. The rest of the money is going towards the other stuff: the food, the hotel stays, the gas for the jet. Um, 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 that's all cheaper. They, that doesn't cost as much. Whereas the main stuff costs a shitload of money. So 600 plus 33 plus 35 sorry. Sorry. 600 plus 33 plus say 35 plus 38 Yeah, seven oh seven oh six million dollars, right? So I have seventy six million dollars left over in the budget, and that's all going towards everything else. But because my budget's so big, I'll have probably a good like fifty million left over in the budget. Seventy million, I'll probably have I'll probably have a good fifty million left over in the budget. Obviously, so I, I'm gonna be putting a good like yeah like five ninety maybe five eighty five towards visual effects. Something crazy. To probably about two hundred million each towards these volume guys. Something crazy, yeah. And Sarah. Um, yeah. Obviously, because the the trailers, kitchen equipment, food, that stuff doesn't cost that much. The hotel stays for all the actors on them will only cost me maybe in total maybe twenty million dollars, fifteen million dollars in cost maybe will, will, will cost me. No, yeah, twenty five million dollars in cost will cost me for that. The gas for the jet won't cost me much. A couple hundred thousand dollars for the gas for the jet. 
renting all the planes will cost me a few a few million dollars. Yeah, it's easy, it's easy affordable, obviously. Is that right? I mean, how much money I'll, I'll probably have a good maybe 50 million left over in the budget. My budget's so big. 40 million left over in the budget, maybe. My budget's so big. Yeah, man. My budget's huge. Is that right? And I'll put a good like 200 million plus towards. Uh, I don't know how much money we'll get burned, but chances are I'll have a good maybe 60 million left over in the budget. Something crazy good because, because my budget's so big, obviously. Is that right? And I'm putting a good like 200 million towards each of the volumes. That's why people be shocked. You're putting about 200 million dollars, yeah, like 190, 195, 200 million dollars towards each of the volumes, Peter. He's like, holy shit. For Lord of the Rings, you only put like 30 million dollars towards uh, Fellowship of the Ring, 35 million dollars towards Fellowship of the Ring. You're putting like almost two, like 200 million dollars each, yeah. He's like, holy shit, Ivan, yeah. I'm sorry, yeah. What I'll do is let's say, let's say um, I only have thirty, I only have thirty million, thirty million dollars left over in the budget, and me and Peter, me Peter and Vijay, we blew forty million dollars towards all the best high tech visual effects technology for the for the movie, and we have five sixty million dollars going towards the three volumes. Obviously, what's five sixty divided by three? That's one eighty six million dollars per. Uh, Per, uh, per what? Per movie. I can take some of my money and put a bit more towards the, the movie office too. Because I want I want at least like $200 million going towards each of the volumes. I'm going to... Yeah, Peter, I want at least $200 million plus going towards each of the volumes. So let's say we only have $30 million, The whole budget's drained. We have $30 million over in the budget. I can take twenty million dollars of that and put it towards put like uh six six point like eight million extra towards each of the volumes, and I can take a good maybe like thirty million dollars of my money, my personal money. Maybe you'll make our money back as apologies. That way, I can put two hundred million dollars towards each of the volumes. Peter, I've been Peter's like I've been one eighty six million dollars each is more than enough money. I this is a relative technology. I'm not more money. My Peter, do you want to make more money? Oh yeah, I'm fine. If you want more money? Yeah, Peter, I'll make her money back. Thirty million dollars is not gonna hurt me if it's, it doesn't doesn't really make a difference. I'm gonna make my money back. <laughs> yeah, Vijay, Ivan, it's enough money. I'm like, no, Vijay, I want to print this thing out. I want at least two hundred million dollars towards you to the volumes. Because even though I'm putting six hundred million dollars towards visual effects, when me and Peter, if me and Peter and Vijay want to get the best stuff for the movie, the best visual effects for all the department, for all the art department, sound department, that might cost me and Peter maybe forty million if you want to get the high high, if you want to pimp it out complete with the high high tech stuff. Peter's like, Ivan, if you want to really, 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 really upgrade it, it's going to cost you tens of millions. How much, Peter? Like $30, $40 million. Fuck it. Let's rent that. And we get the best stuff. We now have five fifty million million going to a vision effects, which is $186 million for fun. I mean, that's enough. That's more enough money. That's relevant really technology. Hollywood, they put like $60 million towards a vision effects, Ivan. You know what I'm saying? $50, 40000000 million, Ivan. This is good enough. I'm like, no, I want $200 million. Okay, fine, Ivan. You can put more money into the movie. And I put more money into the movie. That way you pimp it out more. Obviously. Yeah, that's why people be shocked or mel because I gave him all the budget. I even two hundred million dollars for each of the volumes. He's like, holy shit, looking at a beautiful world. Yeah, Ivan, you know those Chromecast pictures you posted? Yeah, I think something like that, like that, even more beautiful than that. Yeah, it's something beautiful. Eratat the king, the master of devil, walking of the south. He feasts the king bat of the Gilius Mountains, the Gilius City, like Moria. Yeah, man. Look at an amazing movie. I talk with Peter. I'm thinking, Peter, let's watch this clip. I'm thinking something like Prince of Egypt. Peter's like, Ivan, thank you. Like, Prince of Egypt, all, like, all the all the 5,000 sacrifices they journey through the mountains. You have the cursed mosquitoes. You have the jaguars going to the entry to save. Tarkins and them have to beat, defeat the jaguars, obviously. And they go through the caverns like Moria and all the mock battles. They were like, my lord, the reason we are. And all, they're all scared with torches. All, but yeah, holy shit, Ivan, you, 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 you want a masterpiece. This is going to be an amazing story. Ivan, this is be better, my lord. This is a bigger, deeper story, my lord. Ivan, yeah, this is like the Bible. This is like the Bible, but with its own twist. You know, it says Ivan, you wrote a masterpiece. Yeah, he's all excited. Ivan, this is unheard of. Lord, that means we couldn't afford five thousand extras. We only had like two hundred extras, Ivan, and some of them didn't even get paid because Hollywood's cheap. Yeah, 
I heard some of the actual Lord of the Rings didn't get paid. Because I remember I saw the behind the scenes, the one guy is like, oh my god, it's such a long day, are we going to get paid for this? Yeah, because Hollywood's fucking cheap. They gave Peter $90 million budget, man. That's why they're fucking cheap. They only had like 150 extras. Whereas me, I can actually have 5,000 extras. The biggest excess in movie history, like 5,000 like civilians during through the cursed uh, 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 caverns, man. Yeah, man, look at that amazing movie. Best fan story ever told, man. Most bitter. And I'm actually going to build like a one acre mountain, a 0 0.8 acre like mountain, a huge mountain I'm going to build. I can afford it because I'm putting $33 million. People like, oh, you're putting $33 million towards set building? He's like, holy shit, for Lord of the Rings, you only have like a $5 million budget, Ivan. A $6 million budget we were able to build. Ivan, right, for Lord of the Rings, we built cheap sets and we were able to make the world look that good in the movie. I can only imagine how amazing your world will look with these unheard of sets. Yeah, I'm going to build like a mini city of Xanus. A mini city of Sapphires, a nice farmland of Barak, a nice farmland of Cyrus, a nice a city of Barak, where all the demonic wolves live. Yeah. Again, an amazing movie. Damn it. And that's why the Zangus Hackers are lucky, obviously. Obviously. So you guys already know the duties that Peter has to do. I already mentioned this many times in my other videos. Peter has to do all those duties. Help me uh, write the script. Help me sign the four groups of crewmen the first year. Write a workshop. Um, mass designers, costume designers. You know what I'm saying? Extras. And second year, he has to help me sign the stars. <laughs> he has to help me court the three volumes of saying this. You know, you're going to see Peter working really hard. He like he, he Me and him write an amazing script. I have this script is just as good as my Lord of the Rings script. Yeah, it's just as good as Lord of the Rings script. And Fran, I want her helping us out too. And I want her helping him with his notes when he takes his notes after the concerts. He has to do the concerts with me. We got to build the world, all the demonic characters, all that stuff. The weapons, the customs, what the clothing, what, what kind of clothes the, 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 the characters wear in the movie. What kind of clothes do the wolves wear? The Zanians wear, the Syrians wear, the Saffrons. They all wear different clothing. Well, no, they don't, they don't really wear different clothing. But they what? The the the, the Zanians and 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 and, and Sirius and all of them they, they 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 don't really wear different clothing obviously. But I almost pull a sword for you. Tactius when he leaves the wall, he wears this robe. Obviously, and he he he, he goes to Safius obviously, but I I I don't want to say anything without spoiling the story for you. The clothes are the clothes are pretty similar obviously, but um um um. No, the clothes are not similar, but 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 but, but I'm just saying, like, 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 um, um, yeah. Obviously, the only way you can know the guy's a northern is if is if he wears, if if he wears armor and he has a sword, then the the southerns will know that's a northern because the southerns are not fighters. Whereas the Zanians are bred fighters; they've they've been training since their youth. You'll see what I mean when you read. Volume 2, when Tacitonius and Cassius uh, uh, meet the Southerns and all of them. I was supposed to store for you. And they, they, they look down on the, they, they, they look down the Southerns. They make fun of Job and all that stuff. Because the Northerns and Southerns don't like each other. Um, They don't like each other since I, I want a masterpiece, yeah. Please, I have, you want a masterpiece. Like, the Northerns and Southerns don't like each other. Yeah, I have, you want a masterpiece, man. Yeah. The Northerns and Southerns don't like each other. They don't like each other since I the Northerns look down on uh, Southerns, and the Southerns see the, the Northerns look down on the Southerns, and the Southerns see the Northerns as arrogant people. They don't like them because the, the Northerns are more privileged than the Southerns, and they look down on the Southerns. The Northerns are richer than the Southerns. Yeah, think about this. Job is rich. He's Eli's hired caretaker, and Tacitonius and Cassius make fun of him. Because, because they're of the royal family and they're richer than Job, obviously. Even though Job was rich. Because he's a southern. It's, you'll see when you read volume two. It's actually funny. And the wolves hate the humans too. They don't, The wolves have a huge hatred for the humans. The wolves, all the demonic beings in the south hate the humans. I won't tell you why they hate the humans. You'll see why when you read the book. They all hate the humans. Since I They hate the humans. The, uh... The wolves and bats. Obviously. And the Southerns fear the wolves. 
They fear the dangers in the South, honestly. They fear the dangers. I wear masks. The Southerns fear the dangers in the South, obviously. Um, um, because they know Ar they know they're in Aratat's territory. Aratat's the king of the South. He doesn't rule. I'm going to keep saying this. Aratat does not rule. Um, he doesn't rule Cyrus or Saphius. He doesn't rule it. But, like, that's his territory. He's the king of the South. He rules Barak. He's the king of Barak, but he's also the king of the South. That's his territory. Obviously. But he doesn't rule the other uh, humans. But the humans know, know about, they've heard sto horrid stories about him. But they've, the most humans have never seen Aratat before. Because Aratat has not marked the lands yet until Tachy's generation. Why, Tachy's generation? You'll see I don't read the book. I don't want to spoil the story for you. That's why I want a masterpiece. Yeah. Sarah. Yeah. You also have the cursed devil ashes of the south, and you have the uh, the 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 um, the ancestors of the north. That's all I'm gonna say. I won't spoil the story for you. People, are like, yeah, if you want a match piece, man, like, like, man, how'd you come up with this story? I don't know, Peter. You're gifted, man. I can never come up with a story like this, Ivan. This is barely my Lord of the Rings. Yeah, Ivan, like. I'm picturing all season in my mind, like, this movie will be buried in my Lord of the Rings shows you, Ivan. Yeah, it will be buried in my Lord of the Rings shows you, Peter. Yeah. Sarah. So, second year, Peter also has to help me with the main things, too, right? I already talked about all the, all the, uh, the stuff he has he makes it call for. Cameras, um, costumes, armors, weapons, weapons, machines for the mask, visual effects, technology, software, the hotel party, the Virgin Hotel, two-day party, red carpet event, kitchen equipment, and food. I have to help me make the calls for all that stuff. And Peter has to help me sign the uh the star second year all too. Peter, don't be greedy. Make sure you pay Avon Joe his 3.5 Pokemon dollars. Don't be cheap. I 500 k is good enough. No, it's not that great. Pay him 3.5 Pokemon dollars. VJ, don't pay John Mayaga like three million dollars. No, pay him his 8.5 to 8.9 million dollars. And I'll sign Dijibon suit. It was like Temple from our deal. And you give them royalties. Give John and Avon like five point five million dollars of the royalties, and give um, Dijibon suit like six point six million dollars of royalties. Because he's not that big, give him the low end. Give him like six point six million dollars. The way they get paid. So Sarah and they live. They live, they live that great. They're already rich. They they live a, uh, an amazing life. So Sarah and they, and they all we all share the success together. We we make, we give a toast. Success is the future. <laughs> But once we saw him on the side, you take him on the side, they part of my meme, which is like 350 in our condo. And you give a cheer of success in the future. Yeah. From Zara? Yeah. Hey, let's do this video. I'm tired, guys. I don't know how to sign out. Please, I'm going to watch this video. I'm going to watch some rap. Talk to you later, guys, soon. Bye.